This is the 03 Thor 21S Scamper Sport. Got a little outdoor cooking station here where you could put a camp stove and some utensils. Got a, a gray water tank uh, that's additional, just handy to have if you want it for your gray water. I'll walk you around the outside. Domitech awning. It's about a $400 awning. Screen's in pretty good condition. All the way around. A little cargo rack back here. Spare tire. AC units in good condition. Good working order. I just got that screen unzipped there, the tent unzipped. That's why that's like that. Everything's good. Small little, I guess there was a small little hole there, the previous owner put some tape on that. And there's a small little section right here. Previous owner put some tape on there, but let's go inside. Upholstery's in good condition. Got a king size, king size bed to the right. Nice size dinette. Gas stove here. Really good condition. Original stove. It's got a quick hookup. So the, the gas line is right back here. Right there. Sinks in good condition. I want to get this door shut before the wind takes it away. Just kind of some extra storage here. The previous owner built that just to store some stuff. This goes with the outdoor awning. Just a little outdoor space. This is a full size bed. Here's your shower and your toilet. And this curtain, this curtain's in good condition and it goes all the way around. So, all the way around here to totally cover this up. Boom, boom, boom. Go and then you're enclosed there, and you can also have this little room divider here. I think this little room divider is uh, just added on extra. I don't think that was stock. I don't know. But yeah, she's in really good condition. Like I said, I just unzipped this, so this zips back up. So I'm just trying to get some airflow through here because it's hot. AC works. I just I'm not hooked up to shore power right now. The AC does work. It is cold. And there's also a heater. Here's the heater vent. And here is the thermostat for the heater. I was told by the previous owner that uh, when you're hooked up to shore power and it just gets cold enough wherever you've got this thermostat set, um, it just comes on. So yeah. And they said it gets hot. Here it is. Also, this is where the hot water heater is. It seems to be in really good shape. A little bit of storage here. A little storage here. And some storage here as well. Uh, yeah, and all this over here. And this is... A Coleman power cooler so it, it plugs in and cools off just like a fridge uh, yeah it plugs into this adapter right here this guy. 
and this is it has a deep cycle cell battery which I will show you in a second but also read out of your battery power um, and this is electrical panel behind here storage underneath here and some more storage over here and I'll show you the black water tank if I have my keys which should be somewhere I'll do that in a minute here's the deep cycle cell battery mounted up here and there and this is the hookup for the trailer now it's wired so that it's got a five prong actually uh, and this this fifth prong here when you hook up it actually charges the deep cycle the the battery so you'll as you're pulling this down the road you're charging it which is really cool and there's a little solar panel as well that goes with this um, yeah I'll grab boom so you can just set this up and plug it in wherever you want and it just take this guy and plug it into this guy right here and you're charging your battery as you dock your boom docking yeah let me see if I can find my keys This is your this is your black water tank right here. Just pulling some out. That's my first time. Yeah, black water tank. This comes all the way out, and you can dump your water. And I guess this is where you fill up. This is where you fill up water right here to flush your toilet on the inside because it's got that manual flush just pumps water in. Here's the outdoor connections. This is uh, for the shore power. Yeah, I don't know what to say about all this, so I'll just show it to you. And then I did see a couple of outlets out here. There you go, I'm starting to tear down right now. There it is, all torn down. Or put away, I should say.